Hi, I'm Jeff Kermicki, uh, Senior Product Manager at Hunter Industries here in San Marcos. I'm responsible for controllers and sensors. And what I'd like to do is talk to you guys today about uh, a new exciting product that we've developed. It's called the SolarSync. And what we've done with the SolarSync is we've expanded our, our controller product, or our smart controller product offering, um, to include a new exciting product that will allow automatic adjustment of Hunter controllers based on weather. And what we've done with the product, um, similar to our ET system, is we built a sensor and module that attaches to uh, Hunter controllers that have smart port capability. And um, this is the module here. And what this does is it attaches to our controller, similar to our ET system. And it's very simple to use. And the whole premise with the, the SolarSync product is that we want to be able to attach a sensor and module to our controllers and have them automatically adjust controller programming based on weather. And so what you do is you attach the module to the controller and then attach the sensor out in the field. We'll talk about each one of these components individually, but basically when these two are attached together to a Hunter controller, they will self-adjust the controller based on weather input. So what you get is you get a controller that adjusts its, its irrigation program daily. Uh, based on on-site weather conditions, and that's very important too. Um, these sensors are mounted typically on the site um, near the area where they're irrigating, so you get very accurate weather data um, from the site, and that data is actually transmitted to the module that's attached to the controller. Um, to begin with, the solar sink was designed as a simple, very compact sensor, and if you look at the sensor design itself, it has a rain click uh, attached to it. Um, and what this will do is it will shut down your system when it rains. And then on this portion of the sensor itself, this is the kind of the heart of the solar sink sensor. It has our little solar cell or solar dome on top of it. And in, internally, there's a temperature sensor too. And what we're doing with the solar sink sensor is we're calculating evapotranspiration or ET based on those two factors alone. And what we do is we send this ET value to the module. And I'll talk a little bit about the module in a minute here. Uh, and the module itself adjusts the program inside the controller. So again, if you look at the design, it's very compact and there's 40 feet of wire hanging off of the sensor, which makes it easy to, uh, to install. Uh, we've got our little solar dome, we've got our temperature sensor inside, we've got the rain click technology built into it. And what's interesting about the rain click in itself is it's a, it's a patented rain sensor design that allows a quick off of your, your irrigation system based on rainfall. So as soon as it starts raining, uh, the system will shut off. So there's even more savings associated with uh, attaching the rain sensor to or the rain click to your controller. So that's kind of the sensor in, in a nutshell. But what I'd like to show you is the module. And with the module, what we developed is a very simple device that has few programming um, requirements in it. So it makes it very easy for an end user to attach to a controller. And in a minute, I'll show you how it attaches to the controller. But basically, it's designed to mount next to or inside of the Hunter Pro C or ICC controller. And you only have a few programming requirements. One is the time of day. The other one is the type of controller, whether it be an ICC or Pro C. And then the region that you're in. Um, and there's four regions you, you can select from throughout the world. Uh, so it's easy to identify your region. And the reason why we have that is it allows us to adjust our ET value or calculate our ET value um, based on regional characteristics. And then the other one is, and it's probably a little difficult to see here, but just a global adjustment. And we'll talk a little bit more on how it attaches to the controller here. Um, but basically that's the module. I have a uh, Hunter Pro C here, and this is a new Pro C, and it's the Pro C conventional controller. And what we did with this new version of the Pro C is we designed it in such a way where it can actually accept the solar sink module inside, so it can actually mount inside the controller which makes it very easy to install. Um, but the module itself has a little rubber cover that allows it for uh, outdoor installations if you like to, or internal or indoor installations also. But the, essentially the module mounts next to or, to or inside the controller, and then you write, route the wires into the controller itself. And basically what we've done with this module design and the way that the module is programmed is what we do with, with the programming of the controller is we program the Pro C controller just like you normally would. So a contractor would pick up this controller, install it, program um, all the runtime, start times, days of the week to water in the Pro C controller like you normally would. 
he would attach the solar sink module to that controller and essentially the solar sink is designed to seasonally adjust the controller every day so basically it's as simple as pressing the seasonal adjust button on the pro c or icc controller every day based on weather so the solar sink module accepts the weather information this the solar information temperature information we calculate et we send ET data to the module, and the module that's connected to the controller essentially seasonally adjusts the controller every day. So basically what you get is you get the seasonality um, adjustment of the controller based on weather. And that's really SolarSync in a nutshell. It's very easy to use, uh, it's simple to install, easy to program, and very affordable. It's geared more towards a residential homeowner and it's a perfect solution for those that want automatic adjustment of controller programs based on weather. And that's SolarSync.